my name is Rebecca from South Africa. I came to say thank you to the Lord. I came to return the glory to the Lord. I joined PPH last year, July 2023. My friend sent me a link to join. I started joining slowly, slowly, but then I kept on. I kept on uh, praying, believing in God. This year, 21 of February 2024, Reverend Sam was praying on the Zoom meeting. He was locating different people. That Wednesday, he picked my name. And he said to me, I must ask one thing that the Lord, I want the Lord to do for me. I asked the Lord to give me a job in Department of Education. And I asked the Lord to help me with my graduation because I did not have any funds to do my graduation. I did not have nothing. My husband had exhausted everything that he had. At times I, I was crying every day. I wanted to cancel the ceremony that I won't be able to attend the ceremony. While Reverend Sam was praying, one of the Pipitarians, the lady there, said to commented and said she will find she will help me with my graduation. Yo, I thank the Lord for her for her life. I bless the Lord for her life. I bless the Lord for her life. She gave me five thousand rent for my graduation it covered everything i had close to seven thousand for my graduation that i did not get from my mom that i did not get from anyone i got it from the lord people came from left and right to bless me with everything i had gifts i had flowers i had everything thank you reverend sam for answering the call of god thank you reverend sam for teaching us how to pray how to believe in god Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Here is my certificate. I got my certificate on the 16th. I am a qualified teacher. Indeed, with our God, all things are possible. Thank you, Pipitarians. I just want to say a very big thank you to God for everything that he has done for me and my family. Um, in July 2023, I found out that we were expecting a baby and we just we we're just very grateful to God that everything went well. The nine months was a very smooth pregnant was a very smooth pregnancy. Every, there was no complications. I had no reason to be admitted in the hospital for anything. The baby was growing very well. And on the 14th of March, to the glory of God, we welcomed our baby boy and ever since god has been faithful to us um our baby boy turned one month old yesterday so he, this is one month since our baby has been with us and we are very grateful to god i just want to say thank you to him for everything that he has done for what he has done for me and my family and a very big thank you to pastor john for always being there for always saying a word of prayer for us when i was pregnant even when i was about to give birth he was there to say a word of prayer he he I, would, I wrote him on whatsapp and he was more than happy to say a word of prayer for us i'm very grateful to him and every other person that god has been using on this platform to be a blessing to the lives of people and i believe that god who has done this for me and my family is going to do it for every other family who is looking for the fruit of the womb god is going to bless them one just as he has done me and my family i'm very grateful to him thank you so much to everybody that has been on this platform that God has been using to bless lives of people. I'm just very grateful to him and I'm very glad that I am a member of this platform. For without God, all things are possible and everything, everything is always possible. My name is Ogechi from Bulgaria. Hey, brothers, please, I want you to quickly go ahead and begin to share. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, our God and Father. Thank you, our God and Father. It shall not rule over you. Amen. It will not rule over you again. Amen. It will not rule over you again. Amen. What ruled over you before shall not rule over you again. Amen. The rulership of the adversary has come to an end. Amen. Pharaoh is but a noise. Oh. He has passed his appointed time. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever it was that has ruled over you in pain. I hear the Lord saying it will not rule over you again. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. There, there, there is somebody watching me right now. I saw you in the place of prayer and I really want to be sure you are here. I, I saw you in the place of prayer and the Lord showed me how that every time, every time you decide to make a major decision in the right direction, in the right direction. You're watching me right now. Every time you make a decision 
to say okay i want to go in the right direction it is a that moment strange wind, winds of adversary strange winds of challenges strange winds of attacks that's when all of a sudden that's when you begin to see all of them it's like there is a covenant of rest when you are pursuing nothing and then there is a covenant of warfare if you choose to pursue something you are at rest when you are nothing you are at rest when you pursue nothing everything is quiet when you choose not to be anything to pursue anything achieve anything but the moment you make up your mind that you want to go north that you want to rise high all hell will break loose who am i talking to if you are the one just type i am the one because the lord said i should tell you contrary winds must cease now contrary winds cease now contrary winds cease now contrary wind sees now i decree and declare this will be a week of no contrary wind every wind that comes against you shall be silenced from its source shall be quietened from its source i speak to every wind that is against you now every raging storm every adversarial wind i come in the name of jesus and i speak to such winds satanically engineered demonically influenced satanic winds from the pit of hell in the name of jesus christ you win a peace be still peace be still peace be still every contrary wind blowing against your progression walking against your advancement militating against your reaching forth in the name of jesus christ i command such satanic winds such demonically influenced winds your time is up your season is over i command you from source to be quiet and now to be quiet and now witchcraft infested witchcraft influence winds winds from witchcraft covered winds from satanic covers up winds from wicked intentions winds from adversaries winds from satanic alliances winds from enemies and adversaries in the name that is above every other name jesus the son of a living god such winds are brought to rest somebody type and declare contrary winds cease go ahead and oh shut up Contrary winds, you must cease. Contrary winds, you must cease. Contrary winds, you must cease. Eyo na deba sha, e prakos kameri antosha, e shalabantos kabadeya. Shomo, I command your winds to cease. Mabel, I command your winds to cease. Odira, 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 let your wind cease. Yevon, I command the wind to cease. Tamara, I command the winds to cease. Keti. Let your wind cease. Tanto, let your wind cease. Gideon, let your wind cease. Melody, let your wind cease. Is come my father, my father. Let every contrary wind in my life say let them cease. The contrary winds, you must cease. I move forward. I go upward. I advance. Say I progress. Say this week. I go forward. This week. I make progress. Say this week. I 
climb new height. Uh, say this week uh, I reach my goal. Say this week uh, I break new height. Uh, this week uh, I break barrier. Contrary winds uh, cease. Uh, Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Let the intercessor pray. Let the intercessor pray. Here come the Akotana. Here Shade Boratoska. Here Rote Bebatoska. Ito Fela Patoska. Hey, Abatos. In Jesus' name. Listen carefully. You know, you know, please, I want you to watch this. You know somebody in your family that this matter concerns. You know the person. You know someone in your office. It's like every time this person decides to make progress, every time, sir, I was dealing with a case, and, and the lady said to me, she said, Reverend Sam, she said, I don't have a problem attracting men. She said, one thing God has done for me, I attract men. And she said, I don't have a problem choosing one of them. She said, up to that problem, up to that moment, everything is okay. She said, I don't have a problem relating with the person. Oh. Up till that moment, everything is okay. She said, but Reverend Sam, the moment we agree uh. that we will get married to each other and that we have to start plans towards marriage. She said, I have watched it back to back. Uh. That's when trouble starts uh. and it always ends. Uh. That will, I will have to start all over again. Uh. Uh. Who am I talking to hey. him? Who am I talking to? Who are, when it comes to helping people, no battle. When it comes to fixing other people's lives, you don't face any battle. When it comes to helping others to build, Abba, everything will be peaceful. When it comes to supporting others, grazing, no battle. When it comes to maintaining the same position, no trouble. no trouble but you know i'm talking to you hey. the day you make up your mind hey. and say i want to go for my first degree i want to go for my masters i want to go for my phd i want to start building my house i want to move my ministry forward i want to prosper who am i talking to that is when your battles begin this is not a time to jump around this is a time to jump up stand on your feet and say this nonsense ends say contrary winds you must cease i see all of you say you are the one i will mention your name heaven will locate you as i mention your name heaven locate you your trouble come to an end contrary winds end I speak over Sadiq, your wind come to an end. I speak over Irieta, contrary winds end. I speak over Martha, contrary winds end. Susan, contrary winds end. Achuba, contrary winds end. Mkonye, contrary winds end. Beatrice, Contrary winds and I speak over Kiana. Contrary winds and love that. Contrary winds and I speak over that. Oh yeah, yeah, me. Contrary winds and contrary winds and yeah, Porokotoba. Yes, shake the lebata. Let you brahate ya. Open your mouth and declare. Contrary winds come to an end. Evil winds come to an end winds of disease come to an end winds of crisis come to an end winds of adversity come to an end premature death come to an end winds of trouble in the office they come to an end 
Matos, Eshate Bombo, La Copera Cata, Esote Labante. Ay, 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 
you are a helper. Heaven told me to tell you. Heaven recognizes you as a helper. You are a helper. Heaven knows you are a helper. But there is a challenge. When you are in need of help, and it is your frustration now, as I'm talking now, I saw you in the place of prayer. Your frustration now is that you are in need of help. And nobody is ah. coming to your help. Quickly let me know I'm the one. Hey. Just let me know whether I'm the one. Hey. I, I, look at that. I can see all of you just saying I'm the one. You are in desperate need of help. And nobody is coming. Oh my God. You build others. Nobody to build you. You encourage others. Nobody to encourage you. You give to others. Nobody is giving to you. And you are feeling like giving up. Uh, 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 Hear ye the word of the Lord. Yes, sir. The Lord said, I should tell you, uh, don't change. Amen. The Lord said, because of your heart uh, yeah, yeah. and your hand to help, yes, your cry has come to my throne. Amen. And the Lord said, I should tell you, from today, yes. the marvelous help of hey, God. Amen. The marvelous help of God. Yes. The marvelous help of God. The marvelous help of God. Locate you now. Locate you now. Adeola. Receive the marvelous help of God. Shake me. Doris. Craig. Receive the marvelous help of God. Ocon. Receive the marvelous help of God. Patience. Receive the marvelous help of God and Natasha received the marvelous help of God and Tony received the marvelous help of God Saga received the marvelous help of God Michelle received the marvelous help of God Gift received the marvelous help of God Eton received the marvelous help of God Doreen received the marvelous help of God Type and declare, I receive the marvelous help of God. Stand on your feet. Walk around your house. Say this week, I receive the marvelous help of God. Get on your feet. Walk around. Speak to the north. Speak to the south. Speak to the east. Speak to the west. Say, I receive the marvelous help of God. Say, I receive the marvelous help of God. Say, I receive. Turn to the north. Say, I receive marvelous help of God. Turn to the east. I receive the marvelous help of God. Turn to the west. I receive the marvelous help of God. Turn to the south. I receive. Hey! It is located you. You will testify. If you fail to testify, help is located you. If you fail to testify, the help of God finds you today. Within 24 hours, within 72 hours, within the next five days, if you fail to testify, the help of God. The help of God, the help of God, be marvelously helped every day, everywhere, every time, every day, every time, everywhere. Let come to I feel the fire. Your time has come. You shall be marvelously helped. Not a common help. A marvelous help. A marvelous help. Locate you. You are just watching. You are just connected. Marvelous help is locating you. From today, from the north, help will come. From the west, help will come. From the south, Help will come from the east. Help will come. Hey! Far and wide. Far and wide. Far and wide. God 
God is taking you far and wide. Opening doors far and wide. Lifting you up far and wide. Creating opportunities far and wide. You are going far. You are going wide. You are going far. You are going wide. Your business go far and wide. Your ministry go far and wide. Your destiny go far and wide. This week far and wide. No more limits. No more boundary. You go far. You go wide. You go far. Break forth on the left. Break forth on the right. Go far. Go wide. Go far. Go wide. This year. Go far. Shali. Shaya. Listen. Yes. Ah, Jesus. Uh -huh. Please. Oh Don't miss tomorrow. Uh, yeah. That's all I will tell you. Uh, Don't miss. I make sure you join early. But I want to pray for somebody. Uh, yeah. But before I pray for that person, let me pray this one. Everyone that normally helps men, uh. but men don't help you. Stop crying. Because you are to be marvelous here by God. Yes. Amen. Men are not your source. God is now your source of help. Men will now become channel. Uh, yeah, 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 and yeah. anyone he chooses. Yes. From far and wide. Oh, yes. He will bring them to help you. Amen. Bless your hand on yourself. I decree from today. That you shall receive the marvelous help of God. Amen. From far and wide. Yes, amen. According to the word of God. Amen. The Bible says he was marvelously helped. Yes, he was marvelously helped. Yes. You are marvelously helped. Amen. You are marvelously helped. Yes, amen. You are marvelously helped. Amen. In Jesus mighty name. Amen. Can I pray for someone here? And, and I'm, I want you to listen carefully. Before we go on fire. Ah. Okay so this is it. There is a young man the Bible calls Jotham. Is in the Bible. You find that in 2 Chronicles chapter 27 in verse 1 to 2. Jotham happens to be the son of Uzziah. You know King Uzziah. He died in 2 Chronicles 26. Uzziah was the one that God began to help when he was very small. Watch this carefully, please. God began to help Uzziah. And the Bible says, when Uzziah began to become very strong, the Bible says, one day, he decided to enter, because now he feels he's okay. The Bible says, he decided to enter where he should not enter. He entered the temple. Of, took bread. Did, just, he uh. entered where he should not enter. Oh my God. That was the beginning of his forever downfall. And then the Bible said there was a young man called Jotham. And the Bible said Jotham came. And when Jotham became king. The Bible said there was something Jotham did. He entered not the temple as his father did. The Bible says, and unlike his father, unlike his father, oh. unlike his father ah. he entered Shout not the Allah. temple. Mm. Ah. Unlike his father, he entered not where his father entered. That brought the downfall of his father. You will lift your voice to God today. Father, unlike my father's, I will not enter what drowned them. Hey. I will not enter what. Okay. If you like yourself, you will pray this prayer. Hey. You will call your husband who doesn't like to pray. Tell him, Oga, before our family is destroyed by your actions, Ogasa, man of God, you will lay hands on yourself. You would say, my father, my, my father, father, my father. I will yeah. not enter, will not enter what, my what my father's entered that drowned him. David ah. entered. Is ah. entered a little bit. Ah. Absalom entered. Hey. Amnon entered. Ah. Solomon entered. 
everyone in that bloodline that hey. entered what they should not enter, they got drowned. Hey. Abraham lied. Hey. Isaac got drowned in it. Jacob got drowned in it. And Joseph said, I am the Jotham of my family. What drowned them will not drown me. What they entered, I will not enter. I am the Jotham of my family. I will not enter what they enter. I will not make the mistakes they made. I will not make the choices they made. Who am I talking to? Open your mouth in prayer. Say, my father, my father. Say from today, I decree and declare. Unlike my father, unlike my mother, unlike my brothers, I will not enter what they have entered. My father, my father, guide my steps away from what they enter. Keep me from their troubles. Open your mouth and pray. I but declare, I will not enter. I will not enter. I will not enter into the same marriage. I will not enter into the same wrong choice. I will not enter. Lock of elevator. Where are the Jotaps? Where are the Jotaps? Say, unlike them, I will not enter. Your case is different. Your case is different. Go ahead and declare. My case is different. I speak in Jesus' name. Please. Please, I'm begging you. Don't take this. After this prayer, play today's prayer again. I beg you. Madam, pray this prayer for yourself. For the man you are married to. Because anywhere your husband enter, madam, you are going down. If the man enters, you are entering. Because anywhere the head enter, the body goes in. It is a mystery of headship. It's the reason why singles must watch who they marry. Because where the head enters, the body enters. You cannot enjoy your peace when your head is in fire. Or it's on fire. Listen carefully, I want to say it again. The Bible says, Jotan did the right things that his father did. But the Bible says, unlike his father, unlike his father, unlike, unlike your mother, oh. madam, because the way you are going is almost looking like your mother. The way you are talking, the way you are acting, it's like your mother. The way you are handling life is like your father. My mother had to call me 22, 23 years ago. She said, son, she said, I want to warn you. She said, I see you preaching deliverance. You too, you need deliverance. I said, my mother, talk to me. She said, you see that thing you just preached about? That's in the core pattern. It's in your life too. I said, mommy, what? She said, the men in your bloodline. She said, these are the problems they face. Don't be like your fathers. And they gave back to a boy. And when it was time to name him. The Bible said the people look at the boy and they said this boy must end up like his father. Uh, and they said your name shall be John. Uh, his mother immediately. Yeah. She said I love oh, my husband uh, but my son oh, must not end up like his oh, father. Yes, sir. You are not hearing me. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. She said my husband is a preacher. Yes, sir. He's a man of God. Uh, she said but I refuse uh, my son uh, from ending up like his father. Uh, not so shall my not son so, be called. Not so. Not so. Ah, yeah, not so. And she ordered the father come and tell your, your, the people your son's name. And 
and the man showed up and he said your name shall be John they said nobody has ever born such a name in our bloodline yes because unlike anybody in your bloodline this will be the first prophet from the bloodline the first prophet from the bloodline lay your hand upon yourself our time is gone please don't miss to i want you don't miss tomorrow place your hand because our time is gone there are some fire inside me here but i came to arrest the way your life is going uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. you will not enter premature death like your fathers you will not enter a wrong marriage like your mother you will not enter the wrong career like your fathers what they entered that drowned them you will not enter and have it drown you who am i praying for whatever your siblings enter and draw and it drowned them today i mark you for exemption you are marked and exempted marked and exempted marked and exempted everything they entered that swallowed them financial crisis financial challenges marital challenges health challenges today i decree and declare you come out of it you come out of it you come out of it you will not be drowned in it you will not be drowned by it you are set apart you are set apart you are delivered from it in the name of jesus can i speak a blessing over you this week i want to ask for the seven dimensions of favor to rest upon you right now in the name of jesus christ wherever you are just place your right hand on your head if you have your prayer cloth put your prayer prayer cloth on yourself and i want to release over you the seven dimensions you're watching me right now you need to carry the favor of god throughout this week the different dimensions of the favor of god needs to rest upon you single man single woman married person professional entrepreneur whatever it is you do you need to carry the dimension of the favor of god that makes life easy I want to decree that over you right now that from today the favor that brings exemption let it rest upon you the favor that brings promotion elevation the favor that causes men to ascend the favor that causes men to change the levels and dimensions and realms let that favor rest upon you the favor that brings speed acceleration velocity momentum such kind of favor let it rest upon you bringing speed into your life bringing velocity into your life bringing momentum into your life this week you change levels this week you change dimension this week you change realm in the name of jesus christ the kind of favor that brings recognition that takes away obscurity that removes the covering that takes the veil the one that opens you up to men that should see you and honor you i decree that that favor rests on you that favor rests on you the kind of favor that pulls in your direction provision for your vision resources for your project money for your mission i decree that such favor is upon you now in the name of jesus christ the kind of favor that brings distinction that makes you 10 times better that sets you apart that puts you in a class all alone by yourself let that kind of favor rest upon you as i speak in the name of jesus the favor that brings a fine connection superior association that causes men to come in your direction strategic individuals who play strategic roles in your life now let the favor that attracts such men begin to operate in your life you will begin to see men come day by day they will come to help you day by day they will come to help you 
strangers will come to build your walls. Kings and queens will become your nursing mother and nursing father. A people you know not, they will come to serve you. You shall become the desire of nations. In the name of Jesus, I decree over you now the eighth dimension of favor, the favor for progression. Keep on moving forward. No more stagnation. No more stagnation. No more stagnation. It is so upon your life. In Jesus' name. Somebody say, Reverend Sam, I want to put an offering on the ground. I feel grateful. I feel joyful. I just want to put something on the ground. Somebody say, Reverend Sam, I understand from the word of God that my prayer and my giving have ascended to heaven and angelic interventions were sent. That when I pray and I give, it attracts unusual things because God is not a taker. He's a multiplier. Whatever leaves our hand never leaves our lives. It's a principle in life. Vapor leaves the waters, the, the sea, and rain comes back. The farmer plants a seed, harvest comes. A man gives his wife seed, she gives him a child. It is a principle of God that when it leaves you, it never comes back the way it left. It comes back in multiple dimensions like favor, open door, creative ideas, solutions, concepts. It, it comes in form of connection, divine protection. Let's pray over your giving. Father, I pray over everyone giving right now. Generously and cheerfully. Everyone giving by faith and those giving by revelation. Those who are giving a tithe. Those who say, God, I'm giving you a tenth out of what you bless me with. Out of honor somebody else is saying lord you've given me so much i can't be giving you 10 that old testament people give i'm giving more than 10 i'm giving i'm giving graciously as a beneficiary of your grace lord whatever is the revelation back in the givings the faith levels honor your children amen. bless the givings amen. in jesus mighty name we'll pray amen and amen, amen. Now take advantage of the details on the screen. Some of you don't. Even, some of you didn't even have to wait for me. You've already started giving with super chat on on YouTube. God bless you, Nads. You are giving with super chat. God bless you, uh, B. You are giving. God bless you for your giving. Those of you giving from Europe and all of that, Doris. You are giving with super chat on YouTube. Some of you are giving with stars on Facebook. God bless every one of you. God bless you as you give. In the name of Jesus Christ, get ready for ideas, strange ideas, strange concepts. Get ready for favor. Get ready for open doors. Get ready for supernatural connection. Get ready for deliverances, strange escapes. Get ready for supernatural favor, debt cancellation. Get ready for debt payment in one moment. Get ready for uh, uh, getting your own house yes. debt free in the name of Jesus. Finishing your project Amen. in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. The Lord, this will be an amazing week for yes. you. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Let me specially invite you to join thousands from around the world from over 110 countries as we come together Monday to Friday to spend time in the presence of the God who has never failed us for over 1,200 days now. We've been praying every day. We've been seeing revivals, miracles, breakthroughs, open doors. It is simply beyond our imagination how God answers prayer. But one of the things we can tell you is that we are seeing miracles. We are having testimonies every day from everywhere. Because you see, when people pray, they prevail and they prosper. We know here that with our God, all things are possible. It will be a great honor and privilege for me to have you join us Monday to Friday 5.50 a.m. West African time as we turn our attention to the only wise God the one with whom there's no shadow of turning the God who answers prayer indeed with him all things are possible join us every day 